we're going to be expecting a lot from. And of course, the first timers, you have your spirit, your flames, your ends as well, finally making it to the playoffs. Not necessarily people we can count on, but we will talk about experience. We will talk about pressure management, emotion management, the whole weekend with this guy is going to be a red thread. Yeah, and that's something that you both have experienced going off on these huge stages, having to deal with the nerves, having to deal with the pressure. Uh, you particularly devil walk in this major grand final. First major winner. How, how on earth do you deal with that? I think, you know, it, it's a little bit, I think it's more nerve-wracking at the start, you know, mm. going into the stage, but once the game go live, but the, the, you, you, I, I loved it, personally. I, I, I thought it was uh, a great experience. I loved uh, well, a little bit of the attention as well. You like up. the pressure when you beat me at yeah, the major? I, I love that pressure. Uh, I, I, I really do, and I'm yeah. sorry about that. No, it's I okay, it's all right. You I can, had to. You have boasting right. I don't think a lot of people have been at the desk having won a major, so yeah. you have boasting right. Yeah, yeah. And he also kicked me out of the tournament at the time, yeah, so... Yeah, maybe you don't remember that. It's, it's okay, it's okay. You're gonna yeah. gotta yeah. Gotta live with it. You gotta but but there, there, there's the solace it's in the it. fact that uh, yes, I yeah, did win pasitas, the uh, You did. So, right, it's so at least, at least. Yeah, at least that. Yeah, at least that. And you were really close to knocking us out. It was I know. But the difference at the time from, from where we come from, right, is all about Zip. none of us had experience. We were just discovering what the hell that was. Like this new major is coming around the corner. Of course, it sounds so enticing, so tantalizing. Oh, Valve's getting involved. We have this crazy tournament. We have built a legacy, Rush, it's a legacy Rush. of legends, teams that have won it once, twice, three times for the likes of Astralis. And with that timely perspective now, we can make a difference between rookies, people who don't really know what this is about, and teams who have more experience, like the face. I, I love that you bring up that idea of legacy and the multi-time major winners as well, because Navi, they have an opportunity to be on that very, very small list of just three teams that have been multi-time major winners. And that is a huge, huge feat when you look at, uh, you know, the runs of some of those teams. I'm thinking, you know, uh, back in the day, obviously Fnatic, uh, yes. the Brazilian core as well in 2016, Absolutely. and then Astralis uh, doing everybody one up and having three majors. Yeah, I mean, doing it back to back obviously puts you in such an elite list of teams in Counter Strike. You mentioned them the Fnatic, the Brazilian Core, and then Astralis as well. On the side of Navi, we, we have to take a minute to consider how insane it would be knowing what has happened in the world and how it's been complicated for them if they were to now go back to back major champions. And what is even even crazier is that we cannot count them out of it. It's not possible to count Navi out. Everyone has it in the backs of their mind. Sure. Face coming here, favorite. Sure, they won the tournaments before in 2022, but are you really ready to count Simple out of lifting this trophy? I don't think anyone can do that. Yeah. Uh, absolutely not. And I think actually, if I would look at the teams and look at uh, the way they took the path to this stage, I actually think Navi is the one that depressed, impressed me the most because they've been uh, they were dominant. Uh, and and the only uh, one, I think Go. it was only uh, NIP. Was okay, Vara, do you that world of tanks in this the first map that they yeah, lost at the major. <laughs> That's actually How crazy. That's that? exactly what it is. It, it is absolutely incredible and of course uh, we can take a look at the chat and say teams are going to be crazy the stage. Blah, no, no, it's not it, it's not it, it's not it. Yeah, they got a three, they got PS and gigabyte. When you look at Team Spirit, the other team to be joining them in that incredible bracket, not losing a single series through the Legends stage. Yeah, if you compare the top eight that we had in Stockholm, of course, and now you move forward to this Antwerp event. Of course, but Spirit wasn't here. That's the first time as an orc that they're going to be in the playoffs of the Major, which is great for this lineup. Chopper had tried it previously in his career. It didn't work out, but some teams are also missing out. We can take a second to realize, like, the names that we don't have with us, yep. names that they thought we would have with us. We had, obviously, the Outsiders, the XVP core with Yakinder in it, Vitality and G2, the fans in the arena. Props to them for showing up, but obviously with a heavy heart, yeah. not having their teams here. And Cloud9, uh, formerly Gambit, who were here with us in Stockholm, who had to go through the Brazilian treatment. Cloud9, in that Cloud9. Game. Still, still Blood, they are saying, let's say this way, because no, Cloud9 has, has been lost. Cloud9 is not still alive. Cloud9 is not still alive. Yeah, still. Still with 2K. Because well, Tur. It's really good to see that Cloud9 is in the case 2 2K. Ja, ja godīgi, ja skatās šiem tabulu, tad ja mēs svinām pret NIP, tad uh, Spirits un Fury uh, vienalga, kurš tālāk tiks viegli uzvarēt. Visgrūtākais mums pagaļām ir uh, pirmā stāde un tad fināls. 
Finālā būs divsā, jo, ja tik nav vī, tā būs laba spēle. Jā, jo iegodīgi tā kā Pimp teica, ka Navi un Heroic abi ir tā ļoti labas komandas, bet uh, favorīta vēl joprojām tajā ir uh, Navi. Un uh, starp en... Kas? Būs forši zilts skatījies. Jā, jo starp uh, tām vidējām komam, komandām, tā kā Spirits, Fury, Ens un uh, CPH, viņas tās tā kā nav tik labas komandas, kā NIP, Faze, Navi un Heroic, tāpēc ļoti grūti pateikt, ka viņas uzvarēs. I just love the guy as well. I think what's quite unique as well for these teams that we didn't really expect is that compared to some of the other majors, it's a golden opportunity. It's actually open. How many times do we come into a major thinking that a team like Ents could make a run for it? Snappy could make a run for it and have a major, such an incredible line in the history of your career, right? We had in Socom, it was just Navi, no questions asked. The majors before felt like Astralis were not even going to discuss. It was not going to be a negotiation. They would just win it and that's it. We had a handful of teams that could maybe challenge them. Today, with FaZe losing a map here and there, with Navi as well losing a map to NIP, suddenly you have an opportunity for teams that maybe would never ever be again in this position to make a run for it. A heist, broad daylight. Yeah, no, that would be absolutely spectacular. Not counting it out to be happening at this particular major as well. Let's start by dissecting some of those matchups that we just saw on that graphic. Graphic, of course, as you mentioned, Navi coming into this one looking pretty hot, but of course they've got to take on Heroic in their first matchup. Uh, that is going to be, I, I mean, I'm, I'm expecting a full three mapper from that one, considering, you know, the hero heroic we've seen has not been letting teams get in too easily. Sure, they did come in through that 3-2 uh, bracket, but the fact that we've seen them really, really rising up to the occasion and the fact that we're going to see them on the uh, playoff stage for the second time in their careers as well, that's huge. I think it's the main card of the quarterfinals, if I'm going to be honest. Heroic versus Navi, there's so much going into that one. The team from that side of the bracket actually makes it to the grand final. It's going to have such a hard run, beating either Heroic on RV, then the ends of Copenhagen Flames, and finally whoever is going to be in front of you. For Heroic, it's going to be about conquering demons, right? I think everyone acknowledges their level, everyone acknowledges how good of a team they can be in certain circumstances, but we are yet to see it <laughs> when it matters the most. They were that yeah, close, to face. that close, literally an overtime away from making it to the grand final, and now you have to start your run against Navi. It can't be a diesel, you have to be strong from round number one, because Navi is unforgiven. And uh, we've seen strong starts from Heroic. They constantly go out, they win pistol, they convert, they get like 8-1, 6-1, 5-1 leads, uh, and, and, and they go all out. I mean, the energy uh, that KDM brings uh, whenever they win a round is, uh, is just mind-blowing to me. I usually bring a lot of energy when I'm coaching back uh, or when I was playing, but uh, sometimes I feel like he's, he's about to pop, you know, like, uh, because uh, he brings so much passion and energy to the squad, and I think they, they, they kind of get into that mode as well, and they, they fry from, uh, from that energy. I think the biggest reason why I'm so excited to see who are taking on this one is the fact that last major, we were seeing, you know, the, the excuses that these guys have been out on a big land stage, sure. they've been to a major before, they don't have that excuse anymore, so I'm really excited to see what they're going to yeah, you, you're right. There's an expiration date on the... We don't have experience, right? And as a core, they've been together for a while. We have to realize there have been some changes all across the globe, but now we're ready for some colors. Right? And now we are ready to get this major underway. We're going to throw it out to the arena as we welcome the trophy on the stage for all these teams are fighting tooth and nail for. We have been spoiled by many stories. Chronicles from the past that shaped legends. Reasserting old rivalries and uncovering new ones. Train. 
stars. Letting others know Cage that B. are out of reach. Uh, Astral's clutch. Nice. Flying their way to Simple. higher places where hero Ooh. stories are engraved. Still it's okay, clutch. National Icon. versus phase. Shining on their own soil. It's not about frags. Go zero. Just pure art. <laughs> oh, nice intro. Eggs God! Throughout the years, we've been witnessing countless strokes of genius and masterminds succeeding against all odds. Plays that left everyone. Hello, Sakas no deck. No, shut up. Today, we gather to write history. Let the Odyssey continue. Woo! Think of the intros, uh, Major. Ah, Lisa. Yeah, ball. Yeah, ball. Давай. Yeah, You don't have to get stressed. You're too much. Yeah. Es gribu tā atmosfērā būti. Es esmu daudz cilvēku atbalstu majoru. Jā. Es nevaru zuka. Asak, esmu viens tūkstāt skatītājs, skatītāji Twitchā. Ja tu esmu brokīs Jākinders. Ai, labi, Jākinders nespēlē šo reizi. Paga, brokīs spēlē? Jā, feist, taču brokīs! Bet ne jau vienmēr, viņš nav visu sastāvu. Ir! Visu sastāvu viņš nav. Tur ir divi sastāvi. Bet viņš jau bet... Bet brokīs taču viņš spēlēs! There was always an unwavering dream. And now 18 stand remaining within the clutching distance of that ultimate prize. The major trophy. A team can have a cabinet stuffed full of silverware. But it will always feel empty until this trophy is among their collection. Very few players will bear the title of major winner. And the very best will stop at nothing to earn it. To everyone watching around the world right now and here in the sports police, welcome to the PGL Major Antwerp! Man jau maizītas bļeti, ka visa dzīve! Vitālīti, davai šito ieliet YouTube'ā! Čau, YouTube! Šodien mēs skatīsimies... Major? Nē, ko izgaņš esmu? Nē, neliet šo! Antwerp Major! Neliet šo YouTube'ā! Mēs esmu kriņķi! Mēs esmu kriņķi! Mēs esmu kriņķi! Mēs esmu kriņķi! Uh, you know, episodes of our memories. That's what this is. Yeah. We're writing the history of Counter Strike, and it always blows my mind to think that in five days' time we'll all be filled with new moments, new epic rounds, epic journeys. Nenotika dilas sintaya gada. 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 Nenotika It's gonna be a crazy one. And we're gonna get to be writing this legacy. PGL. PGL be Stockholm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Paga, Shay, that's Shayagada. So many new names in the mix. I can't wait to see what's gonna be unfolding. 
alcohol either. And, and something that Frankie mentioned, right? It's the frustration, the broken dreams, something we shouldn't forget about. Some of these players that we have here were that close of winning it already. Of course, your Reign, your Carrigan, that had the opportunity to get their hands on a major at the time, almost primed a team sure, that came into Boston thinking that stairs and then it didn't pan out. The likes of Simful Electronic that had to wait to finally grab it in Stockholm, which we thought was completely rightful for them. Yeah. So for all these youngsters and these rookies out there with very long teeth who want to eat the world of Counter-Strike, you have to have some patience, you have to have some passion. It might just not be today, it might be the next time, but you have to seize the opportunity. And I love that you bring up Karagan Hayes as well. Antwerpa. Um, by the way, we this, you know we were looking at FaZe potentially being a slightly bigger favourites when I we're looking at a pretty open major coming into things. And then NIP on the other side, I feel like definitely right. under. I mean, do we under... Maybe I'm not there. I guess if you have to ask well, me from the very beginning of the major, are they going to be in the playoffs? Yeah, she's in real life. But the truth is, again, nothing below top 8. Nothing below top 8. If you're NIP somehow, they've been always making it to the place. Yeah, they the Turkur Beast still a Copa, that's not like Belgia. I definitely feel like everyone's sleeping a little bit on NIP because I think what they've done, what they've done when they like go into the game plan, the prep they uh, work they've done. You see a very clear line what they want to achieve, and I. I, I the left six goes left, they realize probably that ball is not yours. This is never a potato, Matthias. More if can be Yeah, that's the only case. Last week, stand us around a bit. The beast, the grip attack, sucks. Cut it. Yeah, Bates, it run out. I'm excited to see what they can do. I'm so excited no, to get this one. I'm really sure the teams are ravenous to be getting out onto the stage oh. themselves. So let's throw on over to Frankie to get FaZe and NIP onto the stage in the sports. Let's say, let's say, let's say, me with the Belgians too. Now, in the last two years, NIP have been a team in search of an identity. Some have called them. It's a nice mate, and I've read shit out of any party she got then. With such an impressive performance in the legend stage, we're no longer calling them underdogs. We're not even calling them a dark horse. We are calling them title contenders. But will this NIP make you believe in magic again? Mm, yeah. Why is it okay? Disc das. NIP. Pais da Muti. Da mais sorte, sorte de face guano. By the way. Karigan. Twists. Twists. Uh, who is the guy in South Africa? Brokies! Brokies. And, uh, Brops. And, uh, Brops. That's the Brops. Uh, shits are, uh... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she is. Clan! Sports Relates makes some noise for Faze! Pazies, šitā jau arī balso par viņiem vairāk, tu dzēļ, es skaļāk jau pateicu, jau pārsies to publiku. Tu vai, Fejs! Tu pači, ko tās rokas iedomājies, kāds viņiem bļet var ejams tajās rokās. Jā. Tev satraucies. Jā, nu, visi spēlētāji satraukušies. Nu, es zinu, ko, ne tajā, pati cepumi. All right, then, Carrigan, if you want to come with me and hampers. You know your duty, right? I mean, this is only 
Your second LAN as this roster. How were the boys feeling before you walked out on stage? Super good, super excited, ready to play. But are you ready to play the world's number one? Yeah, but I mean, happy to play anyone. Happy to play anyone. Carrigan, are you happy to play NIP? I mean, uh, I think NIP have played a really great this tournament, so I'm just happy to play a really great game, and I hope uh, the crowd will enjoy it. Twisted say in an interview that you guys, they're hot for you, but you guys, Captain, you saw it the best of one. So how do you know what I mean? Yeah, I think this is what we want to play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, all that matters is that we get a banging first quarter final. Gentlemen, please, final fist bumps. Over there, Thomas, uh, to your yeah. They're all smiles now. They won't be in Game, just a few minutes. Duty, while these Globa, teams get settled FIFA, in, we're going to head back Fortnite, to the panel. Fortnite, G-Mobile, Rocket Leagues, Wolleran. Da, over there, it's not really dumb, we're doing it. Look what they do. I love that we get to hear the energy coming out of Carrigan and Hampus in that little pre-game interview. Yeah, they go, what the fuck? Cast the disrespect to Halo. Hell. I mean, we're not expecting that. Why are you coming back on? Disrespect. Why are you coming? Yeah, FaZe remained the favorite, and it's going to be the story that we will push this? over. This? I think the biggest Ready? tramp, Scare. the biggest obstacle, if you face, is to set your sight on, on the Navi potential grand final. Yeah, shit, I'm now with zero squad, ah? Eh? Disrespect! Disrespect! How you disrespect the Latvian player? NIP have proven us wrong time and time again. They're here now with a revamped roster with Roland that's already making a difference. So please, he knows it. Don't think about what's in, just, just what's in front of you right now. Just what's on the surface. We have time. Time. Yeah, and I want to take the little oh, bit of an angle that NIP, they can go into this game, they can head into this match with no pressure. Everyone thinks FaZe is the favorite. The odd deals! Calm, collected, they can take risks. Don't worry about it. This is the game. Uzvarētais dabūs titulu un 500 tūkstošus. Otrā vieta dabūsim 50 tūkstošus un trešā cerētā 70 tūkstošus. Just jump into our time machine for a second to go back to Stockholm where NIP I thought had a very lackluster performance. Jūs domājies? Jūs brokīs uzvaru, viņi uzvaru pastomā. Viņi katrās sevi sadala 100 štukas. Nē, katram nebūs 100 štukas, tāpēc ka tur ieiet arī manažmentu. Jā, manažmentu viss pārējais. Viss to, ka es būs kaut kāds 70 štukas noteikti. Katram, jā. Es domāju, ka tas 50 to varētu būt. 50 noteikti! Broki! Es domāju, ka es dzīvē viņus arī. Jā! The absolute wombo combo, uh, Rez and Roland for sure. He has been stellar at this event. He's currently the highest rated player for the side of NIP with 1.17 rating and the ridiculous 134 impact. But there is also another number that I want to put forth right now, which I think is massive. It's his T side rating, 1.22. In today's meta, in today's Asian counts, right, where we know it is so CT sided for plenty of reasons. Having a man cool. like Brolin, cool. who can actually have an impact, actually have that plug. difference, opening rounds, multi-killing, when people plug. to do that, that to me is a plug. massive. Yeah, he is a tricky, smart, very, very complicated guy and player. He is incredible. Lance, uh, that uh, uh, spell, deals commands, copa spell, uh, uh, tournaments, that kind. Special as a Swedish player, uh, that the fact that, that he can actually no spell, yeah. hit in the cage yeah. and uh, make calls for Hampus uh, when uh, when it's needed, kind of like a Stalin. Is there much? Is there much? Is there much? Is there much? Oh, the extra scatters, broke the start. No. Profil, Team Face Clan, Roll Upper, Approximate Total Winnings, 313 tūkstoši. Should we just take it for granted yeah. that we're gonna see the Broland from the Nicknames, Latvian laser. I don't think it's that obvious. Yeah, yeah, we have a T-Sag success in players that are going to be in gold into the game. Carrigan. Carrigan's a tough spell, Tess. But I feel like that 
Feizam visās mapēs lielākas iespējas uzvarēt. Ne, nav uzvarēt, bet lielāka bet uz katru mapu ir feizam. Ah, winrates. Winrates ir feizam visu lielākas. Look, there's a counter argument to that. I agree that if you have a good start on the CT side of Nuke, might find yourself in a beautiful situation. You know, you get the sun on your face, you get max one weapons, you get everything. But what if you have a bad start and you're on the main stage and the communication is a little bit hectic? Yeah. There are going to be mistakes, and I think that on Nuke on the CT side specifically. That mistake can lead to a complete, complete... Bago, labāk betro pa NIP nekā feizu! Who are we looking at very quickly to be putting under the spotlight for feiz coming into this one? You know what, I'll go for Brokey. I'll go for Brokey. I think just in general this is an incredibly important moment for him and his development as a player. In 2021 he ended up being in the top 20 but a lot of people were a little bit criticized of his performance not exactly delivering enough. 2022 completely different. Ring is just like a monolith. It's not spell up, bro. I think it's currently the best players in the world. Well, we don't have any bad news. We just took that spell. Grip it, Zerat. Manu, Dream Commando. Robs, Brokies, Manasi, Simple, and Nico. Yeah, Nico. Yeah, I just did. Thank you, Zina. Yeah. Let's try to get a few commandos out of this level. Yeah. Oh, Sakas. Sāks jau! Ēlā, cīņu šķiet cīņu maksā. Šitie cīņi ir atšķirībā kāda kvalitāte, bet vai, ja ir faktori un jūta, kaut kādi ir trīs tūkstoši. Kreiz blokšņi un rītīgi labi daudz maksā. Ā! Nē! 
for the Swedes. NIP solid hold. Three kills, in fact. This is Got the left boost. Hey, so the only broke he left. He waits outside of that smoke, does a little bit of damage, yeah. just like Rez. Brolin dropped to 2 HP, but this is a strong CT start. Yeah, they started off. Indomitable ah. by the setup is perfect here from NIP. And on the just brought up on the desk. Yeah. It's a hot game plan the last time they've come into Nuke. And with DDL behind them, you can see it. It's palpable. Their setups are solid overall. They catch on ramp. They don't fall for this weepy play. They had boost cards. Those are toxic, my opinion. Through, that little fake, that little bit of pressure with Brokey involved. So, with this early pistol start, of course, we look at the conversions. This is where people break when the pressure is too low. They don't have to be like a commandant to be top frag. Yeah. So we'll see if NIP anticipate this. Little bank frag off that doorway. Brolin's blind. He's got bullets all around him. Rain's gonna get an entry. That's one into the A site. That's a potential plant. Got somebody crawling down. <laughs> already Brokey. That could be a potential wrap back around secret. Yeah, check that out. Brokey, he's already moving this one quick. Meanwhile, the retake starting to get ready. Two players inside heaven, two players here inside of main, and that flank still getting closer. Can they pull this off? It's a matter of timing. Brokey comes around the side, does a bit of damage, but the tech oh. lines go dry. And if it's not, uh -huh. dry, it's another here from Nip. A great game plan in this second round. Yeah, yeah, it was the right idea. That's why Kerrigan is a land caller we always talk about. He's not afraid to call a rush in a moment like that. And that is a spot where Nip could have anticipated they wouldn't force. So they try to catch that the major a beast that can move. Is that they go for the long yeah, con. Yeah, I'm going to Fat rotation knowing Nip will take time in the post plant to try to get comfortable before they go for the retake. But it still doesn't work out. The Tech-9 is not strong enough. The fact they didn't get a bomb plan off that first round means they don't have the rifles to lock it in. Credit to NIP for staying clutch. They seal up the second even though it looks dicey just for a moment. I said, Google it. <laughs> yeah. A millimeter off that first headshot. Brokey, even the player who peeked in front of his first victim... I really want to see my part of this. I want to see the damage and survive. Keeps it healthy. Keeps it moving. Some deagles here sprinkled into this one. Brokey, Rain, Kerrigan all picking them up around Rops' scout. Yeah, we've seen the Rops off and not so often the scout. Now, of course, on a round like this, you have no incentive to go too quickly. We'll see if these deagles will work the map effectively or not. Nah, Brokey! That's Rain taken down from the side of the silo. <laughs> Lopsky also going to make this one look easy. So within that first 30 seconds, we're already talking three versus five, and Robs hasn't even had a target to fire back at. They're just going to hide from him. Little peek out from Mini, missed shot. Potentially in this following round, there will be some interesting things to talk about uh. right here. It Ooh. is a total snowball from NIP. As they size up phase, they take him down 3-0 and five alive to get into the first rifle. Big round here for FaZe, establishing in playoffs, <laughs> coming out of Legends, they, NIP are trending up, and FaZe kind of treading water. They had an interesting Legend stage, they were still one of the fastest teams to get into playoffs, smoke. <laughs> but there were moments where you wonder, are they capable right now of taking down a Na'Vi? You know, could they, since they lost at Ants even twice in that situation, could that happen again? No, no. Oh, okay, a smoke is missed, and there's a gap here in the corner. Rain's gonna press up next to it, and Essa tags off, finds him instantly through the window. He goes down. Oh, actually, they're trying to nullify the position on top of Big. Oh, and positionally, they're up. They get into Secret, and they take an opening kill back. Refragging Rain. Robs wants to sink his teeth into this A-site. Plopsky sits on the other end of three players in lobby. Bet pat visas spai iepriekš pārējās komandas arī tagad gan jau skatās, un skatās, kur tiks to laikam. Jā. Jā. Tagad visu to, ka... Jā. Oh. Ko? Tagad visu to, ka es skatās tas spirits un ends, ne, spirits ar... kurš tur vēl pret viņiem būs. Jo tie, kur uzvarēs to spēli, tad viņi spēlēs pret šitām uzvarētājiem. 
straight on the side of the box. Plopsky stops it. And now Kerrigan, with Bomb, has 30 seconds to try and piece this 1v3 together. The first gun round coming out of Phase's T side. A 4v4 with it, despite Esetag getting that first pick. And now it's a clutch, or it's four straight from the Swedes. Yeah. They hear that movement. They're all going to start working downstairs. And Kerrigan comes off of that Bomb plant with enough time to get into cover. Up close, uh. he loses to Rez, though. And that's three to stabilize for Nip as they take their fourth Th round. That was the movement right there. If he had the space, of course, he had to take some kind of risk going to decon would be the obvious move. Getting over to control, he almost made it in time to land that frag. Kuru, <laughs> 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 Looking for the hit, Plopsky, well, he finds him with back's turn, two kills, oh. twist though, he actually broke Brokey, Brokey, twist! It's a shutout so far, I know. instantly, the five round streak, and when we have to talk about Plopsky again, this guy had the opportunity, of course, as a young and up and coming star, to get Ooh, to the top there, and it was to Sean. Everybody that joined the team thereafter ended up being a better player than he was straight up. Now he's playing with Brolin, a former teammate of his, reunited, and they have joined hands at some bomb sites working together, and that's provided a, a space for comfort for Propsky. And we've seen his performances slowly right. ramp up. He's been doing better and better. Upper site holds, of course, incredibly tenuous, hard positions to play, and he is holding his nerve wonderfully. He's got to feel good about that. He's delivering for his roster right now. ドライフェイズ。ドライフェイズ。ドライフェイズ。ドライフェイズ。ドライフェイズ。ドライフェイズ。ドライフェイズ。ドライフェイズ。ドライフェイズ。ドライフェイズ。ドライフェイズ。
Ty Zinka je Armanion Jinx Ocean, ne? Man, Ja, ja tā meitnē nav tā kā Arčiks, tad zin, ka būs laba. Nē, zin kā, viņa nav, viņa ir, viņa ir rītīgi jauka. Tad ļoti labi. Es varu viņu šādien snapoju. Nē! Au! No paid yet. It's. Hmm. F. Yeah, Vsim. I think I suffered from years to watch Jimu score a essay. What the fuck? Crash my streams. No paid yet. Pass this. What's up? What's up? Stream scratch away! What's this? What's this? What's this? What's this? Stream special is a good one to chat up. FF, this is PGL. PGL so bad. Oh, no, dude. Come back, Steve, she dug it. I said, I'll rest you. Oh. Oh. Tiger seven and two. Plopsky eight and three. Hampus nine frags. This is a this is a fully fragging NIP. Not even problematic. Back. For phase, anyways. Rain looking to come outside again from a different angle. Ooh, almost. He's got a player down beneath him. Flashes himself. He's really making his move, and those were just a warning shot for Brolin. Oh man, the presence that he's made is drawing attention. I mean, they have to respect it. There's an opportunity here for them to take this space back, but they turn away. Happens is hunting. Rain looking for a second. Won't be able to get that one, but at least he's created a distraction so that they can push into this A site. But Plopsky does not fall. Oh, Robbie, they're too cut. Stickers is pretty decent. Ah, you know. Fires down Happens. Man advantage in the post plan. It's time to get out. That's a phase round locked up. They are in no position to retake this. And phase put up two. Wow, that's another situation. Well, even if they lose this round, they will be able to get the ball and another kill. And that's a very stressed position. Rain is doing a fantastic job. I mean, if you want to talk about the kills, that's one thing. But his presence outside, staying alive for as long as he did, that had the rotations respecting him. I mean, it was to the point that FaZe had an open ramp completely and were a little bit worried about that fact. They thought, because of NIP's game plan, how smooth is this point? Yes, FaZe win the water. They're going to be ready for this adjustment, but that wasn't the case. We got some exit frags here from Rez as he stays alive too, and this will matter. Faze have some money left over, 
And it does feel like that, uh, yeah, the opulence is changing hands. NIP almost bottomed out. In fact, Plopsky, you got to find money in the bank account to lend to him. I mean, he has been such an important part of the map on this CT side. If he gets stuck with an MP9 and they lose to an upper hit again because of it, that'll be an interesting state of affairs. Now, FaZe, they, they, they reading the money might be kind of difficult. We have no idea what they're going to expect. What they do know, though, is that two guns were saved on arguably, you know, at least the op being the most expensive and important piece. It hasn't come down to that, though. And one of these things with NIP is that, you know, because Asset Tag is on the way up, he's doing better and better, and a huge reason why they get into playoffs. You know, he doesn't stand up to Brophy over time. There's no right. argument there. There's no question. But beyond that, with Brolin bringing in T-side impact, with Rez being consistent, even though he's had a moment or two of darkness, Hampus being right there beside him, they're like ants, not necessarily relying solely on their offer to bring in big wins. Rain is going to continue to try and beat his jackknife. Damage lining up. He is almost, oh, Ooh. dead by Rez, who finds him from heaven. That is enormous to be able to get him out. He has been the guy to scare the clock for NIP. They know they've killed the Lurker, the outside purveyor. And at this point, the map is theirs. It's in a situation like this where you've already lost your distraction, a piece of the puzzle is gone. You have to ask, where is Robs? Not even yet on the scoreboard. Ow. These have some of the best 4v5 T conversions. And at this point in the round, there's still so much up in the air. They still have lobbies of themselves. They're throwing some utility. Oh, but even then, Robs is still going to die. Zero and seven as Kerrigan comes Ooh. back. Two kills. And what's miraculous about this run so far is that Kerrigan has been highly rated, even in the kills department. But Plopsky on oh. your perch, a one and done. Deal for the team. Deal for the team. So finally, by the way, I think it's an Eris Kadar. Four and five, perhaps. Esetag and twists in the mix. Ops on ops. What a moment for Patrick that this would be in a one-on-two situation. We have no idea if he's going to continue with this attempt or not. They stay attentive. He's waiting. He finds his timing. He pushes past. Oh, Twist gets back into the cover. Brokey could come out here. Brokey should just... Yes! Brokey! A nice attempt from Esetag. Patience opened up at least a bit of movement. Yeah. Got onto the bomb site, but ultimately shut down. Yeah, in the most natural spots and... I got that. And not scared of Reds course, like. hallmark, hallmarks of Brokey, always good rotations, very reliable and explosive, and they get shut out. I mean, this is another spot, I'm going to say it again, Plopsky gets another kill in the upper side, even after two of his teammates are dead. So he is finding a way to have impact here through the midst of the chaos. It's another round where FaZe attempt and successfully end upper. Three now as they close the gap between Venom and, and NIP, and they finally find a moment of respite as NIP do not have any money, and that will be clear as day to phase. Oh, Kerrigan! And Ego, and Kerrigan is hunting him through the walls. He can sense them, he can feel you. Yeah. He can smell that fear as these pistols have to fight off. Shut the fuck up! Now he's seeing it live. Ne jinx on the core! Twist awaits his target. Like the name is Boots, yeah, Boots, yeah, Boots. Well, this is getting interesting. Yeah, we already saw what was like a well-drilled strategy. The reps were there, but the frag's not going to be able to slide by. Got again, boy! As that's Brolin taking off the front face of this site, we still have to go to the middle of the skin. But for now, he is. Yeah, Zeno. God. Oh, but Kerrigan, he knows that. Uh, I'm going to swing on me. Swings him down every step of the way, and now Rolin. Davai! Avi kam na kogat me on skins. No, and there's a milestone. Avi kam atris. Ne, na kogat sam neder. Pa gde ćemo kupiti? The economy is very fickle. One day you're rich as hell. The next day you can't buy a McChicken. And this is a position now that suddenly after just taking a glance at the tax money and having ten thousand dollars with an op in hand. But we are back to the buy after that save. Kas cit? Nir? Ja, stoi patek što We've seen the nades destined for Plopski in this position and one just dropped him down to half but Brolin kills Kerrigan who's been such a problem when it comes to that A floor. Rocks is looking for his opening Rez shuts it down. That was a separate 1v1. That was a spot where Plopski could have got rocked if the hut player peaked after the nades came through and they tried to time that perfectly. 
but Pofsky has stayed vigilant. Now not a 4v5, a 3v5. And Brokey is shaky in the legs at 30 health. But think back to those rounds that Rain is able to draw so much attention. Create those moments where the rest of his team can maybe pull the strings. It's going to be harder here, and especially with Hampus locked in. Corey Ooh, with flash. The Oh, that is good Christian. team play from NIP. Yeah. Yeah. Pass his disco there. Little timing flash right there. Hampus had an open oh. line. He could have swung out and it would have been pretty reasonable. And this, this, this kill is show long, right? Wow. Six, six, wow. six mounts now. Out of the round at this point means there is no chance. And phase our team that have Amazing. so much tenacity that even in a spot like that, if they were closer to a bomb plan, if they were three days sweet, they would be trying to work oh, out and go for this. So this is an enormous win for NIP after losing those four rounds. And again, not even relying on an op here. We've seen it on S attack, but it, it hasn't actually been necessary so far. Hey, FaZe haven't had a heavy game plan towards outside. Instead, they feigned presence using a lot of cross smokes and having one lurk go through. And Rain, to his credit, has got tons of space. There was the one round where he died to res, spraying him down on the cross to secret, which is just an enormous pickup, right? And even with that kill, FaZe actually won. So they can continue on with that, but they also have the ability to have a five-man cross outside if they'd like to, to try to go faster towards secret and have something towards lower taken down. But for right now, they've got an affinity towards the upper side. They have a bone to pick with Plopsky. But I don't think they have the utensils. No. No, they're not getting to the marrow. No, no, no that's, Plopsky, thick, that's thick meat. Yeah, Plopsky is thick meat right now upstairs. That last nade maybe going to shake him up a bit. We'll see if he has to change position. But even when he's in the open floor, he's been good towards that door. He's been versatile. Sometimes top oh, site, nice most of the time here. bottom site. T side, get one off. Yeah. Bounces right onto Hampus' head. Big thing right now is that uh, despite Plopsy, we had Brolin has died a couple of times upstairs. He has been taken advantage of. He, he's going to be the guy on T side who's going to be pivotal for NIP. For right now, he's leaning on his teammates a little bit. IGL frame, you know, this this many rounds into the first half, so many different plays have come your way. You get a successful read off, you're gonna be telling your mom about it. Rain working forward with no nades here. He's gonna try to chase around into the mini. Here comes the hit. He lines up. Oh, rain! Rain! Next. Rain clean as can be as he gets in through mini. And oh. that was hinging on Hampus inside secret stairs, maybe peeking up and stopping something like that. That was a set tactic for the Molly to come up so Hampus could peek over top of it. First tearing out Silo, separating his angles, and then maybe peeking to the back of Red, or for somebody who's lurking outside. As soon as Rain saw that Molly, he rammed into Mini, killed the upstairs guys who were relying in that moment for Hampus to be the first person to take contact outside. So whether that was a demo kill or not, Rain has to get full credit for this round. Not from the perspective of aim, literally for being cerebral. Yeah. This could have us taking initiative, understanding the opportunity he had right in front of him. Giving phase a fifth. Five oh. alive as well. Could bode well for this T side. This is a very oh. smart pick oh. for phase. Link out of a Oh, rain. Those glasses, you can see anything. Hit him with the super zoom. Three kills, Rain and Rain alone. You said we've got to praise him. Absolutely. He does everything they needed for that one. He's not playing the best CS of his life, but he is playing the best CS since this new core of FaZe has joined the roster. And that is huge because the storyline for FaZe is world's number one. But there are there was a low four between him and Kerrigan, right? A little bit of inconsistency there. Insane to have potentially three players that be top ten at the end of the year with the twist Robs and Brokey combo. But with Rain, we know he has star player potential in him. Actually, Dragon tattoo. And, and Rain is going to be yeah. right there beside him now. Again, on T side, one of the most important players on the lineup, and showing us why. Oh. <laughs> and this is his chance. You know, he didn't get the play of Cato in the playoffs. Had to watch JKS help his team win, and I'm sure he was proud and excited and happy for his team. But I mean, nothing is going to feel better than being there right in front of the crowd and helping them do it yourself. Awesome to see him slot right back in. Higher expectations than ever, and he delivers. The career phase player. Back in with buys. 
time is relatively silent. Look, no outside grenades in this situation. Turtled up here are NIP in this spot. Really expecting, look how much they're expecting this one thing to happen. No jste nešel spál, nejde, můžu spál, a ty se, já se vědím, mačo. Ne, ne, z grupu skajít, já spíl nejde vysu s mačo s fejzem. Jir! Just to have a 13 and 9 score line at the end of the day. That's his masterpiece right there. Three yeah. players splattered on the exit of hut. Yeah. No footing inside that bomb site, despite phases ferociousness. Yeah, that's his Jackson Pollock all over the floor. And Mohan, I'm gonna bring it back up, man. Yeah. Where is Robs? Those two kills that he have. Yeah. That's that's versus the anti eco when he killed the ramp push. When we talked about the legend stage, we saw a map and a series versus the flames where Robs, for some reason, looked relatively absent. Oh God, the phase. Keep a full. Lila is full. Ah, Lila is zoom and A, right? Lila is F and the thing is phase. Es neredzu to ekrānu. Ā, šitas? Saud! Jā. Ā, šitas streamā, viņš... Šitas maksā... Man šķiet, ka pie tūkstotas laikam. Jā. Ja domājies, viņam dabūt, tas viņam nefīt, 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 nefīt,
Hey, let's do the Keep 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 Oh, very good good but as we switch sides, three round game into the pistol. It's still like Risa's spell, I know is good. Sure, then it's Risa's spell and like a weakness, bro. I like his phaser. We'll see if he'll make it happen. Ah, it was a click, me. He couldn't get that efficacy inside the squeaky as a lurker. But what are these things, buddy? They're just. I swear to all, it's me, it's me, like this, you know, spell is bigger. Listen. But guys like Roland, Rez, they pick up that space. And speak of Brolin, he's dead already. USP to the face. One thing about face, it doesn't matter the scoreline. One of the best parts oh, about man, the team right now, losing or winning, is they always play like they are winning. Oh, oh. that won't be enough oh. to guarantee you the map. Oh, oh, check this it's out. Twists, he waits, he taps into the back of the first, and he's only right. gonna get that one. Essatag's able to turn back around from the bottom of that ramp and help out Plopski before he becomes another victim. Three versus three, but a health advantage for the T side, undeniably. Yeah, I mean, this is uh, NIP with a canvas a little bit, right? They've got the CT scrambling to look back for space. NIP will know that in this spot. Look at him, go. He's looking for his opening. Shots whiz by him. He drops down. Does he tell his teammates to come or go? Kerrigan catches the headshot. He's looking for another. Come on! Oh, he's on him, but yes! Nice. Put on a show. Broke! Yeah, we got the Maestro carrying it. Ah, no, we missed him with these hostings. Yeah, we missed him, because one is a spell, and the other is a team speak. I'm not going to be able to do that. Tāpēc kā grūti saprast, viņam vieglāk ir spēli, un tad... Ā, nē, man šķiet, ka viņiem ir... Viņi dar tā, ka... Viņiem ir noise cancelling headphones. Tā lai viņi nedzird casters, tā kā drunā. Tipo dos komentátor. Já, to bez kavení dalšího sáka příkša. Ne, kato, vás přežili, zpěli, blej, to vidíva sousední, si pata u tás tam mixa, se da gumi, a vini se vajíc bar, ty ty si skáni. They're gonna chill. They're gonna chill with this buy. We've got the two uh, MP9s here for the phase plant. No bomb plant like phase, but no buy where phase would have. One of the nice things that I like to see about this first half performance from Plopsky, we have to remember, he's been at this stage of a major before. But fell empty handed in Stockholm. Yes. Oh, Marked improvement I, in the first showing. I talked to Hampus right after that major. He said, We choked. He said, I choked, we choked. And it takes a big man to admit that. And of course, Hampus, it's easier for him because coming out of the legends at Stockholm, he was the clutch player to bring them over the line. Uh, a leader of the team in terms no, of no, no, and calling. No, no, no. And he tried to work space outside. You know, uh, I was with space. Support systems here, though. Kerrigan. Oh, oh. making money from the tail end of that attack. They making money. Oh, she's lost skin. Yeah. Yeah. It's a dark to take. Yeah, the trap was lost. The new starter switch was like cheddar. Took so much to Yeah. Now, no longer do Faze feel like they're playing worse. No longer do Faze feel like they're not having the start they're looking for. No longer do Faze remember the fact that they got to take Cloud9 down on Nuke in the Legend stage Cloud and get to this point, Cloud9. knowing that that was an easy map to take. What's actually interesting is in all of their last series, I mean, almost seven or eight maps, no team has gotten over double digits except a single one. And I'm sure almost at that point. Just got a stream. 
Absolutely. Yeah, so good, nice, that's good. It's nice to go somewhere and let it be in a function. Yeah, that's good. Do the shit. Well, that's under question as the pressure is on and a flight even further to Hampus. He's lucky to be alive. He'll walk back, leaves a player tucked in. We've already got Robs downstairs. I just need to turn my quick shot. He has one kill in all of the gun rounds of this game. Kerrigan tries to chase, but not too far. Just so that Brolin has to stay empty handed. You press tab right now, you might think, let's take let's let's take the action to Robs a little bit. Let's see how if he's any more comfortable switching over to the CT side. The old blood right now that's bigger for FaZe. Raining Kerrigan, 30 kills. Look at Blazer, he's look weak to me. Got a real classic lurk here. Uh, Was FaZe? NIP. Yeah. And the map overall is very quiet. Rest throwing some nades for GG, himself in this bet. position. And the CTs are ready to catch anyone walk walking. If you get Manta on your side, you'll never really ask. What? Why is it by me? He actually gets taken cool. down. Ooh. Rain finds it outside. Rain Froki fighting. holds ramp. And then escapes. Instantly gone. Decides to activate. But GG, but. wants to activate. Can he catch the back turn again? Yes, because this no, yes, was so incredibly low. S attack turns it upside down towards ramp with that one kill. But he's got an entire CT side to quell. Okay. And so with that, we have FaZe tying this game at nine. Yeah, they continue to be ice cold here on CT side. And again, for FaZe, they, the reason that they picked this map is just that they have had nothing but success. Yeah, I'm not in now. But they did tell Bottle to stay to him. I still have to have a very GG bit of it. We're talking six wins in but a row. Era, that we're going to get spelled. And the only team to get over 10 rounds on Nuke versus okay. them is Ents. Ah, no, they're out of the gun. Half buy in from the ninjas in pajamas. Oh, no, no, no. Rain at the helm of the hold. The city spelled. Where did he go, Mapa? The ridiculous stats. To pile onto that oh, man, God, the gun. 70 percent win yeah. percentage on CT side of new. A walk through smoke just won't cut it. Not today, Hampus. But Hampus isn't the only one who's what sniffing the? out routes outside. Rez will manage to skate by that initial one. Look at this rain back turn. He gets past the garage door. Rez, Rez is gonna follow. Oh, executed. Yeah, that's one in the bag. Dead. Love it. He'll continue his journey. Kerrigan jumps back into mini, flies beyond the squeaky door. Twist is gonna have to take up the job of holding this site, and it's only the one kill. Essentai can't cross easily, not with Kerrigan's hands on that AK. Deep oh, yeah, yeah. Nice, nice. Will nice. With a one round lead. Yeah, we got Robs opening up a little bit, uh, of course. No, Rez on these lurks over and over again. This is interesting. Now, the one thing that looks a little stringy, we look at the uh, phase ED side. All of the nades were being thrown for rain. That's what it's a new job on Mirage. Space and going off of these lurks. Ribe Mirage, just cut it as you don't know what the rest creates space. Rain literally, you took the red as a man to stratus to cover that spell and got all called the bluff completely. So they're going to do the white panel, but this is fair not to cut it in the start of the stratus when you treat me to the way and the bar at the top of the middle. All the way down to the fire, but they throw the wrong guy. Lab Lab is case, miss, but uh. Uh, because we now come on the map overpass. Oh, uh, overpass and that the uh, inferno. Overpass the garlic team up and I'm into it. Now he has a chance. Yeah, Hampus jumps into his arms and Robs. He is angry. He's looking for redemption in this map from Legends. Only an op to play with. May have both given an audio cue, but he's gonna give it up. That's it for Robs. NIP have done it. They've broken into double digits to be two out of seven teams to do that versus FaZe, but the CT side is still looking very strong. The core is not here for FaZe. Brokey has six kills, Twist has eight, and Robs is also on six. Oh, you look man. over to the NIP squad, and you've got guys like Esetag and Plopsky who are right there with yep. Rez and Hampus who have given us those more stable performances. That's a very good point. I mean, we look like point to that upper hold as a great example. It's one where Kerrigan has been trying oh, to help God, both upstairs and outside in this spot. He doubles up as an anchor yeah. playing in Mustang, waiting above Twist, and again, the molly is thrown and leaves a gap on the left side of Hut so Twist can stay there and he doesn't get a kill. Kerrigan has to get two. 
And that's all the upper ah, world has to offer. Yes, so I think what that. you pointed out is exactly right. Well, no. You know, you want uh, to uh, players who don't have a good performance to step up once in a while. But it is actually worrying when that happens too consistently over your core. And the reason is those three players have the most space. They have the best spots, they're the ones who can ask for all the flashes. Should take rest in the spell, it isn't hard to get the kills. Brokies? Yeah, well... It's legit to get the kills, but it's not hard to get the kills. No, it's normal, it's not hard to get the kills. So, I'm not on Instagram, I'm not on Instagram. No. Let's go, watch it. I'm on Instagram. So, I'm not on Instagram. No, it's not hard to get the kills. No, it's not hard to get the kills. Yeah. Their first test in the ninjas. A very green group of ninjas at that. You have to strike that balance between because at the same time if they ever get the Mavi, it'll be a few series from now. It'll be a tough road and they know that they have to be warm right away. And IP again trending up like crazy. It's sort of out of nowhere. Absolutely. I think uh they 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 made that move to get broken. It was T side that was their biggest issue. That was the point that had to keep being brought up. And then the fact that they had to fill the shoes of device and at the tag again in their big games has done enough. But with DJL, with Roland coming in with a 1.20 rating on T side, they have solved these problems directly. What? Oh, oh we didn't kill see that. Range. Yeah, and that maybe maybe we get a 2v2. Well, that's okay. But for now, 10 to 10. And 10 to go here in regulation. If we're lucky. Antwerp, are you still there? Taya. Yeah, they are. Just double check. Yeah, I mean, she probably just rest nice. Today, but they are loud. We got lots of CS to give you, and Twist is going to give it right back. Ah, Jim or money. Made easily through the hunt. Broke is not alive, and we just put these players under question. Okay. So they put the players under question. Yeah, it's hard to imagine that they're going to have to cut the race. Broke to the race. Broke to the race. Phase immediately put up the hold and uh, we get the set play okay. right from NIP. I think that was the time I would have played the lead. Uh, Leeds will send a boost on the one Leeds, uh, uh, Sarkand of Goyari boost on the. In a couple of these spots and very interestingly again being the lurker on the team. Sarkand of Goyari Zivo. It's quite interesting. As I tell you, Tagat Naya, 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 Tipe nakon što je to tako tvrdo podivo si Sarkan dogo, a to je Sarkan dogo je pet minuta šta tamo na mani, na mani smaje. Ja, ja je zrdu. Na tome sada to je sakti, nu, tipe jet, nakon što je to nisi. Varat je, but... Bet. Ne znam ovaj s tako... Man jas da sva iz dzivošu svakom da ugovaj ne, svi s ne znam. Man brav se pats je ovo arī mekla dzivokli riga. Kako brav on gadi? 30. Zipchicks? Yeah. Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
distance between them and the ninjas. Yeah, you know, Twist has a great haircut, but it turns out he's a great barber as well. Oh, Those are two clean kills inside of Mini and one of three players that we have once again referenced need to get back in the server. He ties his kills and death now with 13. Uh, broken 13 kill, I think, eh? Probably going on this dude. Can put up numbers in the legend stage. Like I'm broken, no nuke come up. No, yeah, come on, you're not gonna pick me. No, bleh. Nice, you're dumb. They have the ways to and the expenditure of resources in a spot like this is gonna be too great. Oh, Rob, some problem. The ability to go for the cross, like if they want to, some people be spotted. Oh, oh, oh. Kur problēma? Nietu problēma. Jā, es es pateiks, ka problēma pirms redzēju, ka pie ārā no garāžas ir čels. Es jau iepatīšu līdzēju, ka viņš ir īpatīšu. Šitais nesūda, neizri, šitā bots. Nu, fejas uzvarēja šito. Nu tev jāpiek viņš ir, pēc uzvarēšu to. Protams, ka uzvarēs! Kas? Neko neteicu! Neko teicu? Protams, ka uzvarēs. Jau pagal, cik vispār ilga pauze viņiem ir? 20 sekundes katra pauze, 4 pauzes var iespējams paņemt. Nē, es runāju, bet ne par starp spēlēm. Ā, īsti nezinu, laikam... Desmit minūtes apmēram man, man šķiet. Yes! Rain! Давай, Броки! Ааа! О, такс! Дивило ХП! Я, айде, бля, пасаки мне ничего. Робс, давай! Я! Я думаю, если я не так отпустил, как так без смысла? Divi HP, давай! Hey, yes! Oh, and now, they would have loved to find 
Kurva. Six nine. Oh. 